In this video, I'm going to be going over how to create AI sound effects in Femora 14. All right, as you can see here, I'm logged in and I'm going to go over to these top buttons and click on audio. So go ahead and click on audio and it's likely going to be under the section that says mine. Go ahead and close that and you're going to go over to AI sound effect. OK, click that drop down. Now, the first thing you're going to see is going to be the tool here. And on the bottom here, you have your downloads. We'll, we'll take a look at that in a little bit. But this is where you're going to be able to create your sound effects here. So the first thing you want to do is obviously going to be um, describing your effect. So you can say something like, uh, you know, maybe cinematic uh, movie intro uh, effect, something like that, right? So if we click one of these here, you can kind of like uh, have some suggestions here, right? If you are just trying to explore and kind of like see what types of things you can uh, search for in here, right? So let's go back to. All right. So as you can see, there is a character limit of 100 characters. So there is a limit. You can't have a paragraph long description. And you can also delete this by clicking this button over here. Now, there are some settings here that you can uh, change. So if you click on settings now, the first one is going to be the sound effect duration. So how long is the sound effect? So let's say I want this to be 10 seconds. OK, now you also have the number of sound effects that you want generated. Right. So I just want uh, just one option for this example. Right. And if we move over to the right side here, you're going to see that we have uh, some AI credits here. Right. So if you have a certain type of subscription, it's going to have limitations uh, as to how many credits you can use. Right. So you can learn more about this over here. So with my subscription, I have uh, unlimited. So I'm going to go ahead and hit generate. Give it a second here. So it's going to take its time depending on the complexity of your uh, request and also how many of these uh, sound effects are going to be generated here. All right. So let's give it a second here and see um, uh, what happens. All right. As you can see, it's pretty much done. 10 seconds here. We're going to play this. So if you like what you see here, you're going to be able to download this. So we've played it. If you don't like it, you can click this drop down here. Or you can click this download uh, trash can button here. It's going to go ahead and do that. You can also retry if you don't like how this sounds. So I do suggest maybe creating maybe more than uh, one sound effect. So you have a couple of options. Now, if you like this, you can go ahead and hit download here. Click that download button. Now it's going to go ahead and start downloading this. You can see now we have it on here. Now, if we go over to download, like I mentioned earlier, go to downloads, it's going to show you all the AI sound effects that you have downloaded. And from here, you are going to be able to apply them to uh, your videos here. OK, let's see. Uh, move this down here. But essentially, that is pretty much it when it comes to how you can create these AI sound effects and how you can apply them to your videos. So as you saw here, you can literally look anything up here. So these are going to be some of the suggestions here. Uh, keyboard typing, ring a bell, laughing people, camping fire, anything you want to do. You don't have to go look for them elsewhere. You can have those created uh, on here. So thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one.